Hey guys, MTG Noob here, playing um, some standard with blue black flashback control. Gonna play this swamp out in case he's playing something that needs to be killed on turn one. Okay, draw another land. I would rather have drawn an island there. Uh, I gotta play out my island just in case I do draw an island next turn. So therefore I can play my dissipate. If I need to. Oh, really? Uh, I don't think you can have that. Sorry, that thing does stuff for you. Alright, so that's good. So now I can snapcaster or dissipate whatever he does. I have to assume he's on poison. Um, hmm, the first strike's relevant. Thinking, hmm, I want to kill his Ink Moth Nexus. Uh, I'm just worried he might stick a Bat Mother next turn. And that's pretty good. I'm going to let this resolve. Uh, drawn a lot of land. I might just take the one for one here. Um, I'm going to give it a turn. My only reason for worrying is if he has uh, access to blue mana and has like a mana leak, I might be a little bit screwed. Okay, that's actually fine. I don't mind taking three poison here. Oh my god, why don't you swing? Alright, well, <laughs> thanks. Thanks for the free turn. Um, That was probably wrong. I probably should have dropped the swamp to make him fear the potential of a tragic slip. But... Alas, my hands are mighty quick from time to time. Black Sun for two. I mean, it would be better if I played the Swamp there, but... We're hanging on here. We just don't want to get blown out by, like, a Scytherix here. Um, that would be bad if he just drops a Scytherix. Plague Stinger is A-OK. -okay. Ooh, that's not a okay. Well, I can't do anything about those two at the moment, but we're slowly withering things down. I'm gonna play out my Island. Got a ton of mana going. This is a Scytherix. Hand of Praetors, eh? Uh, yeah, I don't think I could allow that. I mean, he's down to one card. Um, I'm a little bit worried about this. I think I'm actually going to tragic slip his nexus for the simple fact that it's harder for me to kill that and I don't care about the two cards in my hand if he wants to sack his guy that's fine by me. We really need to draw something. We've drawn four spells and a bunch of land. So none of this is good for us. We'll go to two poison. We still have a few turns. Tragic slip. Oh, are you kidding me? I didn't click dissipate, god damn it. Alright, good. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Tight meter just rose to a 10 out of 10. I thought I clicked the wrong thing because it was making arrows and stuff like that. I'm really hoping he tries to knock the cards out of my hand, at least at the moment. Uh, that would be freaking sweet, but I don't think he's going to. 
Oh, he is? Oh, dude, thank you. You're gonna see how sad that made you and not me. Doomblade. Oh, you're useless. Alright, we'll, uh, try to bash in. I want to mill him for some reason, but I can't. This card is just awful. This is a complete blank. Like, I'd rather have land. I can't mill him. Oh, God, I knew it. I knew he had a tumble mat magnet. That son of a gun. All right, so this seems to be, like, mono black poison. And we will mill him. We could actually mill ourselves, but... I think at this point we're just going to mill him. Tumble Magnet is sweet. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Go to combat. I am going to play out my Dark Slick Shores. Because my deck is mana intensive. And can't do much about that. Every time I see something, I get nervous. Because <laughs> we're just so far behind. Oh, man, that's awesome. We Skitherix... We milled two of his Skitherix. As this is... Alright, we'll go up to four. He's put a better clock on than we have in play. With both of our mill slash Doomblade plan. I'm wondering if I should be trying to mill myself. Damn, he's got... So many Skitherixes is is Snapcaster dissipate. Oh god. This is horrendous. I mean I guess I could try to mill myself here. Well we'll see what he does. If not, we'll mill it myself and then uh a little bit not classic. Still got that tumble magnet. Alright, we're going to switch gears here. Probably should have been milling ourselves the whole time. Not 100% sure. I've never been good at the whole mill myself thing. Alright. <laughs> the irony. Look at that. Would have had that. Would have had that eventually. Doomblade's a blank though. Alright, but at least now that I milled myself. Hmm. That's kind of interesting. I mean, I could Snapcaster Black Sun Zenith here. I think I'm gonna Liliana make him sack a guy. Then that'll give us a turn. But then I can't snapcast or dissipate, which is a little bit worrisome. It's probably best to just wipe his board and not be super greedy. I'm trying to figure out a way if I could do everything this turn, and I just unfortunately I can't. Um. I'm not really cared about the pressure. I'm more worried about what's going on in his end. All right, let's we'll try this. I mean, we're not completely dead yet, so the thing that worries me the most is if he has like a lash rife, lash rife equip, just straight up kills us. But now. At least we have a few options. Like, uh, he might just kill Liliana. Yep. Which is fine, because that buys us a turn, and that's what we want to do. I don't know what this is. Don't you tap mana. Alright, well, he's going to play a spell, apparently. Uh, another Plague Stinger doesn't really do much. Alright, we'll mill ourselves one more time. See what other goodies we can put in there. Mana leak, tragic slip, island. 
Glad we milled the island. All right, naturally drawn black sun is always good. We still lose to a hasty Scytherix. Actually, we don't win Mana Lake now. So, I'm going to just get in for two, Black Sun for one. Wipe both of our boards, but it's still good. This Doom Blade is such trash in my hand. And if he does nothing, I can consider Snapcaster. <sighs> that does nothing. Tomb Blade actually kills that, so I'm all good with that. Alright, I think I'm going to actually uh, just mill him now. Because that's essentially going to be our win condition. Ink Moth, Ink Moth, Ink Moth Island, uh, Swamp, excuse me, Whispering Spectre. Another Drown Yard. I will gladly play that and speed up our clock. Um, I don't think I necessarily need to kill that. I think I could wait. The mana isn't really too scary in a sense that <laughs> the mana apparently just became scary. Alright, that's fine. We'll allow that. He's gonna come in. I'm gonna take the one. We still have one of Black Sun in the graveyard, so I'm not insanely worried. Mill him for three more. Ooh, Corpse Car and Life's Finale and Grasp of Darkness. Not too worried. I like this deck because we're like, it's like we're playing with fire here, which is always fun. Okay, Plague Mirror. Bunch of stuff. Crusader, Swamp. I would have definitely liked a Curse of Death's Hold there. That would have been sweet. Uh, alas, I think we need to do our thing. I mean, I can get sort of greedy and block, go to nine. I don't want to do that. And then I was going to say, yeah, you know what? I'm going to be greedy. Screw this. We're feeling bold here. The only thing I'm worried about is Contagion Clasp, as that screws us. We're getting greedy. Alright, Doom Blade that. Um Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna take it. <laughs> so great Blake's so greedy, it's ridiculous. Alright, well Cat's almost out of the bag here. Gonna have to do things eventually. Alright, a few more things. Plague Stinger, ugh, another land. Another land is not good. It is sucky. Alright, I guess we gotta go all in. And this sucks, because now we're probably going to lose, because we were way too greedy. Like, last turn, I probably should have played Snapcaster, and then just tragic slip this. But it's all good. Uh, Black Sun, Doom Blade, Dissipate. Alright, well, we're both playing off the tops of our decks. 
<laughs> and uh, my man across from me has three cards in hand. And I myself, not so much. Black Sun for two. One, two. Say okay. Alrighty. So, definitely a loose game, I'm not going to lie to you. But it's fun, at least. Here comes something. We put ourselves in a horrible spot. Like, we just die to, like, an ink moth axis. <laughs> That's how bad it is. But I guess he's flooding because he's just sitting there. All right, so he's going to be at 18 cards. We need a... We need a come on top deck. Come on top deck. Alright, well, that will stay in my hand. And we apparently need another come on top deck. Alright, well, he's alive to basically anything. So we're going to do this right now. Tumble magnet, land, land, beautiful. Alright, we'll do it one more time. I am not advocating good play for this match at the moment. I'm advocating having fun. Alright, well, we hit <laughs> four irrelevant cards. Oh, no, don't say it ain't so. Alright, that's essentially going to kill us before we kill him. So I'm starting to think if I would have just milled him those two times I milled myself. Urgh, so close. All right, well, good game to my opponent. Let's uh, go to sideboard, and we will tighten ourselves up a little bit. So fun. I had so much fun. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Um, tribute seems good. Seems unnecessary. This, he does have corpse car. Seems unnecessary. Image doesn't seem good against him. Liliana seems pretty sweet. Batter Skull seems like it blocks for days. I want another one of these, and I want one of these. Um, I don't think I need these. Doom Blades, definitely not, although they kill Ink Moth Nexuses. Ratchet Bombs, I don't... I mean, I think they're okay. I don't think they're fantastic. Cut one Ratchet Bomb. You know what? I don't like the ratchet bombs. Actually, I don't like the doom blades. All right, let's do this damn thing. Let's man up here. Yes, I would like to play first. Oh, yes, I would like to mulligan. All right, I uh, hate this hand, but it's going to have to get there. It's not amazing, but we're also both mulled 2-6. So that's always good and we have some outs in a form of drawing cards we also have a ghost quarter which is good at killing ink moth nexus is, is. drew another black sun that's always nice okay you do that dark Slick shore is fine not going to trade the one for one here i don't i don't actually mind Taking one point. As we saw, I only lost by one last turn if I didn't take all those risky points of poison. I don't know. I was just I was just feeling it. If only I had some sort of spell that can kill his guys. Alchemy? Um, hmm. I guess guess I like the one of Ratchet Bomb here, but I think it's going to be too slow. I think I'm just going to take Liliana. And I guess we'll both tick up. Or I probably won't play Liliana yet. I'll probably just Black Sun for one here. I'd like to draw a Curse. A Curse would be good. Drown Yard is good. Let's Curse... It's Black Sun for one. Wipe his board. And this way it puts us in a better situation to 
kill what he's doing on his side if he's doing like playing one guy here. Hopefully it's not a corpse car. Which that's fine. God, that guy's good. Uh I don't know why I bought this in. That was stupid. I just realized how bad that, that was. Alright, let's do this. And we gotta have a Liliana, so Batter skull? What? Apparently, I'm slightly on crack at the moment. The way I sided this in. And worm coil? It's just terrible. I don't know. <laughs> Game three, if it goes there. We're going to have a much better plan, I promise. Corpse car. That's weak. I dislike that. Okay, he's getting back. I would assume hand. Yep. All right, drown catacombs. Me like catacombs. Uh, I'm gonna play out the batter skull. Cause you know how I roll. Uh, I'm tempted to not chuck the land, but I think we'll be fine if I chuck the land. I mean, I want to be able to protect Liliana for the turn and I want to be able to wipe his board and then kill something after with a Liliana. Oh, he has Black Sun Zenith, huh? I guess that's good. I guess. I don't know. Apparently we're both on the... Hey, we suck at sideboarding plans. Alright, this is probably a Tumble Magnet. Nope, alright, that's fine. I will be blocking with my germ. There's no reason to not be blocking. Oh, you gotta... Yeah, I guess you can attack there. Alright, um... Let's see if he wants to block. No, I, I guess I shouldn't have done that. I could have got in for one damage. Hey, let's see... He didn't want to attack. Let's see if he wants to block here. Alright. Yeah, I was thinking he didn't look like he wanted a block. I will do this for two. Black Sun for two. Wiping his board. Saying okay. Um, I don't want to lose either one of these cards, to be honest, so let's just pass. Not in love with this plan, but I have to keep the Dissipate for the potential Scytherix, although I can always make him sack with Lily, but I'd rather keep both of these cards in hand. Is that another Corpse Cur? That's totally fine. I, oh my gosh, I could care less about that. That's like such value for me. Alright, um, we'll just each discard a card. I don't mind chucking extra land. Alright, I get a few options here. Um, first being that if he plays something that I hate, I'm going to dissipate it. If he plays nothing, then I'm going to probably alchemy. This is probably getting destroyed. Yes, I actually hate that. Eh, do I really hate it? Yeah, I think it's better to just dissipate this here. I mean, I want to bounce this. I'd like to draw cards off of this, but I think we're in a spot where we're okay. Alright, let's make him chuck his card. Once again, we're in essentially the same position. 
We're just ticking up Liliana. If he doesn't do anything, I'm just going to... Alright, that uh, does not bother me. Options are... Let's see where it's coming first. Yeah, I think we're going to go score to that. And then I think we're going to alchemy here. I think having the batter skull is good, but now I'm not in the spot to actually replay it if I don't draw the land. So we'll alchemy. And then... Hmm. I like all of these cards. A lot. I like them a lot. Uh, I'm going to take the Black Sun Zenith. Just wipe his board. And then tick Liliana up. Do you like having Mana Leak there? We're basically, we're cold to a off the top Scytherix. Which, you know, is possible. I'm gonna ditch this mana leak. It's not really doing anything amazing. I probably I probably sequenced that pretty poorly. I probably should have just Liliana'd um to get him to sack his creature. And then I could have I didn't know he was gonna draw the mana leak, but then I could have held like Snapcaster or taken a land all those things. But I have a feeling we're just in the good. Especially now with the dissipate. Oh my god, that was terrible. It's like you talk and your finger does not listen. I swear. It's like my brain's like, well, the dissipate's uh, pretty awesome. I like dissipate a lot. Uh, it's good and blah, blah, blah. And my my hand just clicked on Liliana and now I'm gonna I'll tumble magnet, I don't care. I was gonna say, oh and now I don't care. Alright. I guess we'll drown yard him here since that's gonna be one of our ways to kill him technically. I don't even think I wanna like ultimate Liliana to be honest. I mean it's okay. It's not amazing. Snapcaster for nothing? Yeah, I'm going to wait a turn. I'm going to learn from my terrible mistakes. And I'd rather have Snapcaster Mana Leak than nothing at all. Okay. Why the hell would you do that? Why would you tumble magnet your own thing? That's weird. Are you just that locked out of the game that you don't care? Then don't play. I mean, seriously. Is it because your name is Mad Mike and you feel you have to be crazy? Like you're living up to some sort of expectations now? Uh, curse is good. But I'll chuck it. I mean, I love Curse. Eh. Yeah, I think the only card we lose to is still Scytherix. Everything else is all good. And we just gotta protect that. Do, do, do. We're protecting it. Man, playing control is crazy. Um, mm, yeah, I can't do anything about that. I will try to mid. We got the slow mill plan going. If you love mill, 
and you love 3 times 11, then you're going to love 11 more turns of this. Alright, Liliana is still high enough where now we could just do things that are like stupid, like Snapcaster Dissipate, Snapcaster Alchemy, etc, etc. All right, we'll take a poison. Ouch, my face. And bounce this. Do we even need to? No, we don't even need to do that. I was seeing before if he wanted to sit there and, you know, attack Liliana. We're just milling, like, spells and stuff. Nothing insane. All right, let's make him sack a dude. You, sack that guy. All right, and we're going to speed this up a little bit on our end, because we're only at 12 minutes. Uh-oh, what is this nonsense? Is this a blight dragon? No, you, you can't have that. Corpse Cur is essentially whatever he feels like at this point. I think it's better to just get value off of the Dissipate here. Since we have another one in the yard already. We can take the Mana Leak, but... I don't want him to start chaining, like, corpse curs or whatever. What the hell? Oh, alright. Well, you're probably thinking I'm crazy, but apparently... Dissipate is gonna do nothing this turn. I am awful at magic. I swear, it's like I'm trying not to be. Alright, we're gonna do this thing. We're just going to try not to lose to a Scytherix off the top. What did he even get back? Yeah, he chained a corpse car. All right, that's fine. We will make him ill. promise you. I wanted to make a dissipate happen. So that's two things where where had happened that are terrible. All right. Chuck some guys at 24 cards. Let's see what we have. Maybe it's like just a Grave Titan win the game. Tribute's good. We'll use that now. This way we'll gain some unnecessary life. We're still like super screwed to a corpse car uh not a corpse car i'm sorry to a skitherix now we're okay bash is for four taking our time taking our time i need a black sun zenith bash in who cares can't do anything we'll bash in oh, shit we could have bounced our batter skull. This game is degenerated. I'm sorry. I guess after the 30 minute mark, I'm just like, ugh. Oh, that's awesome. All right. Well, we still get to kill that. Yay, it's a blight dragon. All right. Let's uh, rip something awesome off the top. Here comes the awesomeness of a drowned cat comes. All right. <laughs> uh, yeah, this sucks. This is like terrible now. All right, bye, Liliana. It's been nice knowing you.
All right, we're going to play that. He's got 22 cards. I probably should have boarded in some spell bombs. Okay, this is just going to be a corpse car. Recur the Blight Dragon. That's pretty sexy. Uh, let's see. Can we mill him out from here? 1918. Bash is in. Now I got to, unfortunately, do my thing like Forbidden Alchemy style. Another very loose game. I have not played this deck in about a month, so please forgive me, and you can flame away and be like, you should have on turn 14 of game 2. Um, I can't believe you, you know, misclicked or were just terrible. You know. That's what happens sometimes. Alright, Curse of Deathhold does nothing. Mana Leak does kind of do something. So we'll take a Mana Leak. Curse of Deathhold. I, I think I was... The problem was all the Lilianas and how terrible I am with them. Oh, that's a big boy. Um, yeah, I like that plan. I mean, I like Mana Leak a little bit better, but if he has a land... No. Alright, we'll get one of the cards in his hand. And then he'll have to tap this down. Bash this down to four. Which is fine, because I could still get rid of his dragon. Karn is liberated. Apparently, you get rewarded for being terrible sometimes. Like Siding and Batter Skull against an infect deck that's right hey i'm not gonna lie he was he was really trying to kill my batter skull so maybe i got some secret tech all right i don't even know what card we got let's see what mad mike exiled Ooh, a whispering a whispering specter he's so whispery all right that gets tapped down. That's fine. Yep. You bring the blight. It's also fine. Man. Is he going to put me to 8 poison? That would be pretty awesome. I would not hate on that. He's putting me to 8 poison. This guy. All right, well, his Tumble Magnet still has one counter on it. Let's see what we got here, Black Sun? Think twice. I think we shall. Think twice again. Hmm, I didn't even think we could think twice. We're going to lose. What is our out? Go for the throat. Ratchet bomb. Another snapcaster. Alright, well, we know what we got to do. We got to, first, we got to remove the blight dragon. Blight dragon. Sayonara. Okay. So, Blight Dragon goes bye-bye. Then we gotta think twice again, or we are screwed. Come on, one time. Give me one time. Oh, Dark Six Shores. Alright, well, we'll see if he misses it. But I don't think he's gonna miss it. Look at this. Look how bad we, we're losing this. Alrighty, alrighty. Alrighty, alrighty. What is this? Another Blight Dragon? Corpse Cur. A. Alright, that's fine. Cur it up. Recursion. Man, we, uh, we got our butts kicked. And there's really no reason for it. So, if you spent the majority of this 40 minutes hoping I was gonna get there, I'd like to just apologize because I did not get there and I played very loose. Look at Manalikas. 
but then it just shows him we got nothing. And playing loose is bad. All right, you get to do that. You get to tap my guy. Don't do it. Don't tap my guy. Let him stay in play. Oh, and you still got all these Ink Moth Nexuses? Oh, blowout. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Hopefully you enjoy seeing terrible magic. Thanks for watching. I apologize. Please subscribe. <laughs> I know you want to now. Oh, we're so dead. We're so dead. I just want to draw. I want to just draw some cards. Just do it. See. Oh, blue sun. Oh, look at this. All the shit shouldn't even been in here. All right. Well, sorry again. Thanks for watching.